I am on my way to a different gym this morning. The lighting sucks, I'm really sorry. We're in some Alphalete, feeling good. Driving my brother's car. Thank you for trusting me to drive your car in Florida. I truly appreciate it. Hi, uh, I have a partner number. Okay. It's uh, two. All right. Where's that from? Canada, oh, like Montreal. How you doing? You know. You know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Are you on vacation or like what? Well, I was born here. Yeah. So I lived here when I was younger. You know. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Thank you. But thank you. Have a great day. You Thanks. I just saved some monies because I work at Starbucks. I work at Starbucks and I've never tasted this, so. What the? F Why don't I make this when I go on break? This is stupid. That slaps. So I just went to the grocery store and I. I'm in a good mood. I'm enjoying my time in the store. I get to the cash register. The girl, the cashier, I'm like, hi, how are you? How's your day going so far? And she's like, you know what? It's it's doing pretty good. And I'm like, yeah, how's your shift going? She's like, I've only been here an hour, so it's not that bad. I cannot express this enough, but do you know how a simple conversation like that can change someone's day? I was authentic in every single one of my words. My intention there was to brighten her day. I was sending her love and she didn't even know it. I was literally saying in my head, I love you and I hope you have the most awesome shift ever. I was paying and she looks at my tattoo and she's like, what is that? For me, it kind of represents like loving your inner child and all that stuff, but it can mean anything you want. It's like someone holding someone else. And she's like, I like it, it's cool. So I was like, thank you, that's really nice. And I was making my own bags. Someone that works in an establishment should never work for you. If you think that a waitress works for you, you're an ass. Without them, you couldn't get your fucking service. So make your own bags, clean up your own shit, be so polite, holy. A man behind me says something, I'm like, sorry. And he's like, you are so nice. And I was like, we have to be nice to them, sir. They're here for us. You know, like, they're, like, without the cashier, I couldn't have bought food. Do you think she wants to do that all her fucking day? No. I'm sorry. I'm just like, people are so miserable in the States. They're so unhappy. They could kill themselves in front of you. But you just have to be a space of love. So I did get a lot of low vibrational unhealthy foods, but I don't live here. And I wanted to, like... You know, I didn't want the family size, but like that's all they had and like it's really really good. Holy shit, this is like crack. I'm gonna bring this back home. It's Dunkin's Pumpkin Spice coffee. So I'm gonna make coffee at home. I can't smell it. Cucumbers, cause uh, health. So I decided to try the Dunkin Donuts iced coffee at home. We got some almond milk pumpkin creamer. I'm so, is it raining? Florida is a bitch right now. Then I found some pumpkin spice waffles. Cause hell yeah. More Uncrustables cause I'm, holy fuck, I love these so much, man. Egg whites, broccoli. I found pretzel pop tarts. Do you know how good that sounds? I got the cinnamon sugar. We got some soft baked pumpkin cheesecake cookies. This is really unhealthy. This is all bullshit. This is not food to eat on an everyday basis. No one should buy this, but I don't live here. I want to taste the Jenny's ice cream. Apparently it is so good. So we got the gooey butter cake. Let me turn you on. Cream cheese ice cream, crumbles of vanilla cake, and a swirl of caramel butterscotch. That's it. Okay, so I feel like trying one of these. So I'm gonna try the pretzel Pop-Tarts. It's good. Worth the calories? Hell no. So we are on our way to go get Chipotle because I don't feel like eating chicken and veggies. I want to go pay more money to have it taste better. But you can understand. I don't live here. I don't get to eat Chipotle whenever I want. I was dressed like a hobo. So now I look like this. Florida belly isn't too bad. But if I push it out after water, pew, you look sexy. I'm so sad. What shirt, shirt is so that? Large. I've, I've never seen that. No, I've never worn it really. I'm gonna put some cheese in guac and sour cream, mama, to pull. Like. For you, baby!
Point loop. He thinks you're funny, so be funny. I appreciate the love, honey. No. Final test taste of the day. I'm trying the ice cream. I'm scared to like it so much that I can't stop, but. Fuck, this is like. I love ice cream, bro. I wish you guys could taste this, man. All right, I'm gonna close the vlog. So I'm gonna try to stop eating this as soon as I can. It's bedtime.